इन्फेक्शन इज पॉसिबल For some women an episiotomy causes pain during sex in the months after delivery an extensive episiotomy might also contribute to fetal inconsistency after childbirth the new approach your healthcare provider might recommend an episiotomy if extensive vaginal tearing appears likely your baby is in an abnormal position your baby is large fetal macrosomic your baby needs to be delivered quickly if you need an episiotomy and you have you have not had any type of anesthesia or the anesthesia has worn off you will likely receive an injection of a local anesthetic to numb the tissue you shouldn't feel your healthcare provider making the incision or repairing it after delivery There are two types of episiotomy incisions midline or median incision A midline or median incision is done vertically A midline incision is the easiest to repair but has a higher risk of extending into the anal area mediolateral incision A mediolateral incision is done at an angle A mediolateral incision offers the best protection from an extended tear affecting the anal area but is often more painful and might be more difficult to repair the role of warm compresses and tissue massage during the second stage of labor when you are pushing your healthcare provider might apply warm compresses or warm mineral oil the tissue between your vaginal opening and your anus This might soften the tissue and help prevent tears in the skin. Although the evidence for warm compresses is stronger, some healthcare providers also massage the area between the vaginal opening and the anus as labor progresses. This is known as perineal massage. Healing from an episiotomy. If you have an episiotomy or tearing during delivery, the wound might hurt for a few weeks. especially when you walk or sit if the incision or tear is extensive the tenderness might last longer and its stitches used to repair the episiotomy will usually be absorbed on their own soothe the wound cool the wound with an ice pack or place a chilled wet hazel pad between a sanitary napkin and the wound take the sting out of urination pour warm water over your vulva during urination and rinse yourself with a squeeze bottle afterward prevent pain and stretching during bowel movements press a clean pad against the wound when your buttocks are you lower yourself to a steadied position sit on a pillow or padded ring passing a bowel movement sit down carefully tighten use medication as needed Your healthcare provider might order prescriptions medications or recommend an over the counter pain reliever or stool softener. However, pain relieving creams or ointment haven't been found to be effective for episiotomy wounds. Consider complementary treatments. Some research suggests that lavender might help relieve pain after a tear or episiotomy. If your healthcare provider approves Add a few drops of lavender essential oil to your bath water or apply the oil directly to the tissue between your vaginal opening and your anus. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, do click
click on the like button, share this video on Facebook, Twitter and WhatsApp and don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you.